I'm Anil Kumar and here's a bonus question for you on applications of quadratic functions. Question is, find the value of k for which the function f of x equals to x square plus kx plus 2 has a minimum of 1. Right? You can pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestion. Now it's very important to understand that when we say find the value of k, this is the unknown k, for which the function has a minimum value of 1. So that means the value is minimum 1 for the given function and we need to find that value of k, right? So how to do this type of a question? We know that x square plus kx plus 2 is a parabola so it is going to open upwards like this, correct? So that is how the function is. And minimum value will occur at the vertex, this value. So what we can do is we know what this value is. Let us say this value is, uh, we don't know the x value, but we know the y value for this is 1. That is a minimum value, but we need to find that value, correct? But in any case, if you have a parabola with this kind of a situation, then you can write equation of this parabola as y equals to x minus, we don't know what this point is, so let me write this point as as p right so x minus p whole square right plus one since one is the minimum value is that okay so like this we can write down our expression now let us expand this equation so if you expand this equation we get x square minus 2px plus p square plus 1, correct? So this is what we get as our new equation where we are saying this value here is, is p for us. So we don't know what this value is, but it is p for us. We don't know what this p is, right? Okay. But if we compare these two equations, then what do we notice? We know that if these two are same, if we say that this should be equal to I mean, if this is equal to x square plus kx, because that is the equation given to us, then when we compare them, what do we get? We get that p square plus 1 should be equal to 2, right? That is the constant part. And minus 2p is equal to k, correct? So that is how these equations are related. So from this, we can find the value of p. So p square plus 1 is 2. Let us solve for that. p square plus 1 equals to 2. p square equals to 2 minus 1, which is 1. And p will be plus or minus square root of 1, which is plus or minus 1. So we get value of p as plus or minus 1. So that is by comparing these two, right? So what we did at this stage is that we compared these two, right? And got the value of p. Now, to find the value of k, we can compare k is equal to, we say k is equal to minus 2p, right? Minus 2p. Now, p could be either plus 1 or minus 1. So, we get k equals to minus 2 times 1 or minus 2 times minus 1. So, that gives us minus 2 or plus 2, correct? So there are these two values of k which can give us the answer, right? So now we can write down our answer that k is equals to plus minus 2, right? And therefore our equation will be f of x equals to x square, it could be plus or minus 2x plus 2. This particular function will have a minimum value of 1. Do you get the idea? That is how the question should be solved. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.